Hi and welcome to Free Guitar Lessons Pro. I'd like to show you guys how to play um, quartal voicings. These are used in uh, in jazz a lot. They're good for uh, good for harmonizing melodies. And I'm just going to go ahead and and get started here. So uh, just start with this one. Uh, I'm up here on the uh, 17th fret. And uh, so first of all, I'm just going to let A ring for all these chords so you can hear what the root note sounds like. And then I've got uh, G on the 17th fret of the D string and C on the 17th fret of the G string. Then I've got F sharp on the uh, 19th fret of the B string and B on the 19th fret of the high E string. So you play all five of those notes together. So it's just a chord built out of fourths in the A Dorian scale. And uh, it has all these other chords that you can, you can play. It's called a chord scale. If you just take that interval stack and then move it diatonically through the scale. And that mean, diatonically means that you stay within the key signature. And you know, I'll, I'll just play the shapes and you'll be able to see what they are anyway. So it doesn't matter. So this one. Uh, so these are all fourths. This one right here, that's a flat fifth because that's there's uh, three whole steps in the scale right there. One, two, three, four. So it's uh, when you use all whole steps, it puts a tritone. It makes the fourth into a tritone, but all of the other notes are going to be perfect fourths. And the next one is uh, F sharp, B, E, and A, and the frets just starting on the D string going up. Go, uh, go 16, 16, 17, 17. And then the next one after that is the same shape, just down two frets. And then uh, you've got this one, so there's another tritone introduced there. It's always between C and F sharp, and then every other interval in the chord is gonna be fourths. So 12, 12, 13, 14. And then to keep going downward, I've got 10, 11, 12, 12. So there's the tritone, right? C and F sharp every time. And then uh, B and E. And now I've got uh, B, E, A, and D. And A, D, G, and C. And then when I get to this chord, now I'm back on the original chord shape, but I'm 12 frets down. And then uh, it would just continue um, from there with the same shapes, but there's only a couple more, so I'll just play them for you. Fourths, fourths. There'd be one down here, I guess, but. So let's make a little, uh, exercise out of these. Um, let's go up. And uh, so they can be taken all out of sequence. I would recommend just playing them up and down till you get used to them, you know, make up little riffs like. Well, the point is that they can be used to harmonize any melody in the in the scale and uh, so like I think there was a, a, a chord lick that Kurt Rosenwinkel played that um, that did this it used these uh, fourths these quartal voicings they're called quartal quartal harmony uh, 
and then it uses them to outline a uh, arpeggios that are in thirds, which is called tertiary harmony. You've got quartal is four, tertiary is three. So uh, if I just take this pattern that's like, you know, take that pattern, which is thirds, That's the whole pattern if I wanted to continue it. Anyway. That's all the lick is. And he, I think he plays these voicings that are, it's like the same um, ones that we're working on right now. So, um, it's like I'm skipping over the second one, that one, I'm not gonna play it. I'm just gonna go to that one skip this one and go to this one, skip this one and do this one. So you get this. And uh, now I'm gonna play the same idea except instead of starting on B, it's gonna start on A. So I'm gonna get the stack, diatonic stack of fourths in A Dorian down from the A note and then down from F sharp, and then uh, down from D, and then down from C, and then down from B. So it just ends with a, it just ends with that uh, three chords in a row. So playing the whole thing. So that's just an example of like one thing that can be done with uh, with chordal uh, chord voicings. Thanks for watching Free Guitar Lessons Pro, and uh, give me a thumbs up or uh, some comments. Leave me some comments. Subscribe to the channel um, or take lessons from me on Skype. Just uh, send me a message and uh, and we can get started with Skype lessons. Thanks for watching Free Guitar Lessons Pro.